Good morning. This is EBS Live. Please remain standing and join Delena Blackhorse, who will be performing O Canada in Blackfoot. Charlie and Delena. have a story to tell. It's an opportunity for us to share our culture, about who we really are. Everybody in the world has an Aboriginal past, but they're so far removed from it, from thousands of years of separation. It is a great responsibility, I believe, to present my culture in the most honest and historically accurate way possible, because I might be the only one that they ever meet. They need to leave and to say, without them, we would not know Canada as it is today. They want to beat the drum. They want to dance the dance and feel it in the heart and be able to remember it forever, because once you hear the beat of the drum, you'll never forget it.
Good afternoon. It's The Late Show on EBS Live. Hello, EBS community. Do you like magic? Do you want to show your magic? We want to see your magic on The Late Show. If you want to show your EBS your magic trick, go to BBS and find the magic show slide and upload the video on the Google form and click submit. I can't wait to see your special powers. Abracadabra. Mrs. Carigati Cardozo. Bonjour tout le monde. Ça va très bien. I'm doing well this morning. A hectic start. <laughs> Getting the tops and little ones out the door to school. But we're here for a terrific Tuesday morning. How does that sound, Mrs. Carigati? That sounds incredible. I am so excited to head to Brian W. this morning for part two of our EQAO. It was so nice seeing our grade three students, seeing some of our grade six students come in in person to write EQAO. And I do really need to give a special shout out this morning to our ISSP team, our grade three team, and our grade six team. They have worked so hard to make sure that this has been a seamless and effective experience for all our students. So grade three teachers, grade six teachers, our ISSP teachers, thank you so much for all the hard work that you put into making these next few days so successful for our students. That's so true, Mrs. Cariotti. And today will be part two of the EQAO writings. We want to wish all of our grade three and six friends all the best of success. Don't worry, just do your best. We're proud of you and all that you are doing. So as we look into our Tuesday today, please make sure if you're going outside that you're protected, wear sunscreen if you need to. Whatever we do, let's be safe, let's be kind, and let's be the best students of EBS that we can be today. Take care, everyone. <laughs> 